the power ring. So what we're trying to do with these short films is just get the kids' attention, get them to laugh, and introduce the subject. Of course, there's no such thing as a power ring that helps you with your prayers. But there is a verse in the Bible that says, if two shall agree on earth is touching anything, it shall be done of our Father which is in heaven. So we don't need a power ring. We just need the Bible and verses to stand on. That's what causes our prayers to be answered. Now the prayer of agreement simply says this, if two shall agree on earth as touching anything, that they shall get what they ask for. The prayer of faith is something you can pray by yourself. You don't need another person. But the prayer of agreement, you need another person to pray this prayer. Why would I bother with getting another person if I can pray the prayer by myself? Because there's more power when you get in agreement. The more people you get praying that are in agreement. Of course, if they're not in agreement, if one's in faith and one's saying, hey, I don't think it's going to work, that's not agreement. That will actually hurt your prayers. But you get two people that are in unity, that are in agreement, that believe the same thing. There's great power there. And so there's a, a story that's gone around for years about a farmer whose sons were always fighting over their inheritance, always fighting over the family farm. You know, the father was getting up in years and he was about to pass on. And, and the older he got, the more he saw his sons bickering. He had seven sons. Uh, and so what he did one day is he took seven sticks and he, he wrapped a cord around them. And he said to his seven sons, whoever can break these sticks, I'll give him the farm. And every son grabbed the, uh, the bundle of sticks and tried to break it, but they weren't able to break the bundle of sticks. And every one of the sons tried it, and none of them could do it. And so what the farmer did is he untied the bundle, and then he took the sticks one at a time, and he snapped them in half. And he said to his sons, if you guys stick together, nobody will be able to defeat you. But if you allow the enemy to divide you with bickering and strife, you'll be destroyed one person at a time. And so there's great power when you can get people in agreement. And the Bible says that one will send a thousand to flight, but two will send 10,000 to flight.